Alrighty guys, Sassy the Clown back once again with a Learn to Draw and today Robert off YouTube has requested another video and today he's requested the Thunderbird 1. And Robert, I'm going to show you how to draw the Thunderbird 1 real quick. Here we go, we're going to use some colours. We don't normally use colours. Some grey, bit of red, bit of blue. Get your black back out. This is how simple it is. It's really that easy. Get your pen, make it a bit smaller. Here we go. One, two, arrow, square, smaller square, bigger square. Wing, wing, look at that, it's really this easy guys. Triangle, wing, Thunderbird, one. Nailed it. That's how easy it is guys. It's really that simple. And I wanted to rush through Thunderbird 1 solely because, do you know what, Thunderbird 1's cool, but one thing that's even cooler is Thunderbird 2. Thunderbird 2 is amazing. So I'm going to put in a little bit more time because it is that easy. You saw how easy Thunderbird 1 was. I didn't even time that. How long was that? How long was that? That was one minute, not even. So here we go. Now we've got Thunderbird 2. Let's get it. Let's get our colours out again. It's all about the colours. You start with a colour and it's simple. It's really that easy. So here's what we do. Big green blob. That's it. Another blob up here for his uh, back wing. He's got a tail wing and he's got some wings that stick out the side. It's pretty well lit. Chuck the bits that join the wing on and then like I said before, get out your black. So now we're going to just go around, do the outlines in some black that easy it really is that easy we nailed Thunderbird 1 just like that Thunderbird 2 is gonna be no harder guys so you're just gonna grab this follow that top line that's all you gotta do follow that top line around and then this next line see this next line is only gonna go to here because we've got some jet engines so we draw a jet in no not quite like that we might be more of an angle so you're gonna draw a jet engine here this one's just gonna follow the jetter engine jetter engine follow the jet engine around like so and then again follow that back around to the wing Back around to the uh, the wing thing at the back. He's actually got two turbines at the back here too, but we'll draw them on later. So the wing just goes straight up. It's this simple, guys. It's really this simple. Once you've done that green, you're just pretty well outlining everything. Go and outline your wings as well. They point forward. I know it's different to most wings, but hey, they're Thunderbirds. They'll do what they want. Just follow that a bit better like so. And we're pretty well done. This turbine here, just to give it a bit of depth, you want to going to draw one line down there. Thunder, the whole of Thunderbird has just a bunch of lines on his back. That one got a bit crazy there, a bit wild. It's that easy, guys. Just a heap of back, heap of lines, just like a um, like some like some gills on a shark. You've pretty well drawn a shark gills along the side there, and you've nailed it. He's got a, it's got a cockpit around here somewhere. Let's just get a bigger pen, save a bit of time. Bam, 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 bam. Cockpit done. Consider it done. What else has it got? Like I said before, guys, jet engines. Pretty well, just draw two big squares. Square, square. Join that up, put a circle on those. Speed lines, can't forget speed lines because that shows the speed of Thunderbird 2. And uh, and then get out some white. So these are just the little details that are going to nail it. Obviously a 2. So we've got a 2 on there. Simple. Down the side here. Thunderbird 2. Easy. Thunderbird has got a white line that goes over there. Probably doesn't hit that too. So let's just, for the point of the video, slide it around there and it goes around the edge of that. Um, little lines on here, little lines on there. Pretty well done it. That's pretty well lit, guys. These back uh, two, two boosters are actually yellow. So we'll just do them yellow so it all matches. That's pretty well Thunderbird's done. It's really that simple. Now here's the point where I say, I say it every time. It really is that easy. And I've said it so many times that you just got to go in, put in... Not with yellow, get your black out again. And you just want to go in and you just put in the details. This is where if you want to put some details in, give that a bit of depth, colour it in. Like I've said before, put some put some shadow lines if you want. Chuck some of these curves on if you really want to. Uh, same, give it a bit of depth. Let's just colour the bottom in, make it look like it's, you know, just like that. Maybe give some depth on these wings. Another little trick I'm going to show you. This is free of charge. Like once before, free of charge today, guys. A trick with your cartoons, doesn't matter what you're drawing, I'm just going to throw this in for, for free. Get a thicker pen, draw a thick line around it, and this is really just going to make your drawing pop. Make it like as hot as a hot plate, you know, dancing like a chicken on a hot plate. Draw a thick line around the whole thing, guys, and your drawing is just going to stand out like no one's business. People aren't going to be able to miss it if they want to. 
That's pretty well it, guys. That's Thunderbird 2. Thanks so much, Robert, for sending that in. Oh, sending. Commenting on this. Anybody else want to know a drawing? Just comment, please. Hit a comment. Tell me what you want to learn to draw. I'll show you how to draw it. It's really that easy. Simple step. Get a thing. Like. Subscribe. Give me a suggestion. I'll knock it out for you. And uh, that's about it. I've been Sassy the Clown. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you in the next video. Sassy the Clown, out.